Made in Hollywood, I know, right? <laughs> <laughs> was this movie made in Hollywood? No. Right? This was made mm. around the Los Angeles area. Was it? Yeah. They just tricked it? They they did. They they tricked it for sure. Yeah. Yeah, we cheated it. <laughs> <laughs> so you don't normally do drama films. This is kind of a stretch for you. Why did you want to tell this story, both of you? This is definitely the most dramatic film and role I've I've done. Um and I mean, for me, I just wanted, uh, when I read this script, uh, I just, I, I love the story. I fell in love with the characters, and I knew that this would be a complete departure from anything I've done before, and I, I wanted that challenge. It, we were talking because we, we both felt this way, that um, both of our roles kind of scared us, and I'm kind of just learning now that um, I get the most fulfillment when I do roles that scare me. Um, and just kind of dive into it with, you know, no boundaries or fears. Just go for it. Yeah, because when it challenges you, it really challenges you on levels emotionally, not physically, but uh, things that you also have to be prepared to have a camera rolling on as you're experiencing it as well. And, you know, for me, I've been fortunate to play all these super strong characters, um, and this character to me was not that. I didn't see her as strong at all, I saw her as completely broken and weak and her strength came from something that wasn't even discovered yet. And so I had to kind of find that along the way. But to be able to play someone that is completely, everything's been taken away and uh, you know, to be able to like, not wear makeup, not do hair, not have fancy clothes, like that, was, that wasn't the scary part for me. That was actually the exciting part, <laughs> you know? To just be stripped, stripped away of everything, honestly. She was stripped of everything, starting from zero. And I had to work, I really had to fight. I had to just, and that was, that was, it was really fun, but super challenging, yeah. Interesting that you explained how you discovered that you like roles that challenge you, something that you've never done before because you find fulfillment in that. So what would be a future role that you would want to try to play so that way you can meet that challenge again? Oof. Oh, that's a very good question. <laughs> it's funny, too, though, because I feel like you don't even know what that role is until it's presented to you. Yeah. Yeah, it's tough to map it out. It's tough to be like, yeah, that's the that's the thing that's gonna challenge me. Right. It's kind. It kind of for me, it uh, it has to do with like the roles I've been doing, and so if uh, if I've been like playing one role, I kind of want to switch it up and do something completely different. Um, yeah, like almost just do the opposite, just because, and and then it just becomes a challenge because you're just working a different muscle. Not necessarily like it, it might not be something you've never done, but now you've got to do it in a different way. You know, how do you show strength in a different way besides like, you know, here I am. This is, yeah. I don't know. It's, um, but it's fun. That's why I think we love being actors is because you really don't know what's going to be thrown at you next. I actually saw this movie at home, so I was I was writing as I was watching it, but I ended up not writing because I was watching the movie the whole time. I was like focusing. Nice, on it. big compliment. Um, big but, compliment. Yeah. <laughs> so it actually got my attention. But um, there was that one scene between you and Nico, who plays Oliver, your brother, in the hotel room. It's really climactic. It's dramatic. It's extreme. It's intense. What was it like shooting that scene with him? Brutal. <laughs> He's 13 years old. And he was 10 when we filmed it. Yeah. Really. Yeah. And he, he's so good in it, too. He's, he's so fantastic. And that was like our, I think that was our second to last filming day. So me and him had already, we, we truly developed this bond together. And we became very close while filming. Um, and that was the very end of the journey. And uh, that scene was so hard to do. I mean, for, for me, because I just like, I fell in love with this kid. And to have to have to get that intense with him was, was heartbreaking for me. Um, and he's he's so good in it. That's exactly what I was wondering. That's I was thinking, how could he get so into this scene? Because I feel like I would want to stop and be like, I'm sorry. I know. I, love you. I know. And it gets like it gets like physical and emotional. It's it was it was tough. And I have to say, like really, I wasn't there the day they shot it, but knowing that they were shooting it that day, I had such an, a, an a amazing amount of guilt because I was like, I've done this. I've brought this on. Ugh, they bonded and now they're gonna have to, ugh. And it was just like, I was just like, wait, Constance, you're not the character, you're not the character. It's all gonna be okay. <laughs>for watching this interview as always don't forget to subscribe and let us know what you think in the comment section below for the next made in hollywood interview click right here do it click it <laughs> <laughs>